Hey, welcome to the Windows channel. And as we uh, wait together, because I can see that there's a lot of people actually waiting with me uh, to midnight Eastern Time, North America, where possibly, possibly, we will have the first installs of Windows 10. So let's cross our fingers. Um, just some interesting facts about the uh, install here. Um, there is uh, uh, there's a few articles talking about how the Windows 10 download actually affects the internet at large. Now I've not seen any slowdowns personally, but apparently um, there could be some slowdown due to the tremendous amount of data Microsoft is pushing for the Windows 10 downloading to our machines. So uh, Windows 10 rollout could break internet traffic records apparently. And um, actually usually what happens is when something big, a big event might happen, a company can ask uh, the CDNs or the content delivery networks for some space to send all these bits and um, as of yet some of the biggest and most widely uh, watched events that really makes a lot of bits out there were Apple events. Apple events um, that were live streamed peaked at 8 terabits per second that's an enormous amount of data even the download of iOS 8 on iPhones and iPads created uh, around 3 terabits per second, which is pretty amazing. But Microsoft actually asked the big content delivery networks like uh, Akamai, uh, Edgecast, Level 3, Limelight Networks for 40 terabits per second of capacity to send out all that information, which is huge. And um, they were saying that this afternoon, at a peak this afternoon, um, there was actually 10 terabits per second being used for the Windows 10 installs and downloads of the bits that we're all getting. So it's quite amazing. And um, it's really, really something, you know, to, uh, to, to, to note here. And uh, basically what happens is that the bits are sent on these big networks, but the pipes slowly get smaller as they get through your own internet service provider. And actually they were saying that some internet service providers, if they have lots of users actually downloading Windows 10, might actually have slowdowns. And so um, actually I was just curious, I did a few speed tests to see if I was at my peak uh, 60 megabits per second connection and uh, yep no problem here so it seems my ISP is pretty good with that but uh, it's an interesting facts and so if you um, you know notice a slowdown on the internet for the next 24 48 hours uh, and maybe a few days well it could all be because of Windows 10 and um, you know there's a lot of hype on Windows 10 so I'm not surprised at the number of downloads that are possible and how much data this takes so uh, you know while we were waiting uh, I get these messages all the time about oh let's do, do another video do another video uh, we're waiting for Windows 10 install and so I thought this would be an interesting little th fact to send out to you uh, guys and girls out there and um, I am pretty amazed at the amount of data actually being sent out. So we're breaking internet records with Windows 10. Uh, if you enjoy my videos, why not subscribe and you'll be informed when new videos are online. If you have any comments, questions, go ahead. It's always fun to have your feedback and um, hope to see you again.